Hey y'all, my name is Morgan Mosley and I'm the Airstream Specialist at South Haven RV and Marine in South Haven, Mississippi. And today I finally have the privilege of being able to show you guys an all new Airstream Atlas. So here is the Atlas, the world's best Class B Plus van. So how cool is that? So on the Atlas, it takes about 350 man hours to build the uh, the house portion. And after they're done with that, an additional 350 man hours to do the fiberglass finish and the paint job on the sides. You see how the side sticks out a little bit over here? This is an Airstream Interstate, just a standard class B. There's no extension over here. But what that does is it gives you a lot more room on the inside, as well as provide you with a lot of outside storage space there's no outdoor storage on your regular Class B. But on your Class B Plus, you do have the outdoor storage. So uh, we're gonna walk around the outside really quick to kind of show you some of these uh, details, and then we'll go inside and look at the fun stuff. So you will notice that there is the armless awning up top. It does have the seismic sensor, so when it detects, detects strong wind gusts, it is automatically going to come back in on its own. So entrance to the coach there, but we're gonna show you the, uh, the outside real quick. So talking about the outside storage. So down here, motion sensor lights, storage bin number one. Inside this one, you do have two 110 outlets, cable jack, as well as some USB ports, a place to send some cords through here in case you wanna hook a TV up outside underneath your awning on a nice day, watch the game or whatever. You can hook it all up right in this compartment right here. Another uh, storage place right here. So these doors to the storage, the outside storage, there's no handles on them. They wanted to give you the world's best Class B Plus, and in order to do that, they wanted to leave it the outside sleek and automotive looking. So they did not want this to look like an RV, so therefore they did not put the handles out here. Um, but yeah, as you saw, just open it with your hand, and then to shut it, lock right here. That's where it connects. So put it shut. And so whenever you lock your doors, it's automatically gonna lock all your storage compartments. So 15 coats of paint and clear coat, cut and buff finish. There's absolutely, you cannot tell that this is a multiple different paint surfaces right here. You cannot feel the transition between these colors It's as smooth as it can be. Um, something else you'll notice, there are absolutely no seams on this entire coach. On every other thing, on every other uh, Class B or motor home, you'll notice a seam right here. Everything that connects the house to the chassis has a seam, but they wanted to give you the very best. So they filled in all those seams. Uh, so you'll never have any leaks where those seams might be or anything like that. Exhaust for your furnace. Down here, it's gonna be your diesel generator. You got a Cummins own diesel generator. So your Air Airstream Interstates will all come with the propane generator, but with the Atlas, this generator will feed directly from your uh, diesel tank that uh, runs your motor. More inside storage under here. And above, you have this one in here. Motion activated light. So tall storage here, cedar lined. It smells really good in here, the woven vinyl bottom right here but you can fit a lot of stuff in this tall storage bin around the back side over here you notice all these sensors these are airstream sensors uh parktronic parking your backup camera see this is not a window it looks like a window you don't have a rear view uh mirror in there because it wouldn't do you any good so this camera is, it gives you a constant feed to your rear view mirror and that so there's a there's a, a monitor that hangs where your rear view mirror would normally be that's constantly showing you what's what's behind you if you need to tow anything as long as it's below five thousand pounds this does have a five thousand pound receiver hitch seven way plug brake controller all of that got your slide out right here so down in this compartment, this is gonna be all your utilities. Macerator pump. Got the motion activated lights, macerator pump right here. Outdoor shower, hot and cold water, city water inlet, 
um, over here is going to be your 30 amp power plug um, cable outlet fresh water valve that right there is your exhaust for your generator so you do have a diesel generator but you still use propane for some of the things like the furnace and the, uh, the cooktop so this is where you'll fill your propane So this is going to be your exhaust for your hot water heater. You do have the Alcoa aluminum rims. So on this slide out, really cool slide out. It's the only Airstream that actually has a slide out and they put a lot of thought into it. So you have these two storage doors right here. So they, went, so they put a lot of thought into it. So in most slide outs, you're going to have to go up underneath the slide out to be able to get to your bins, but they incorporated the bins into the slide out. So you're not having to bump your head on the slide out just to get to them. They're right there and they go all the way through. So you can put some golf clubs, you know, whatever it is that you need to carry that, that might be a little bit bigger. You wouldn't be able to take in the interstate. You can put it in this bin right here. Dream Atlas. They all come with Continental tires. Mercedes Sprinter chassis, the 3500 chassis V6 turbo diesel engine. You're going to get roughly between uh, 17 and 19 miles per gallon with this thing. So now let's go inside and take a look at some of this stuff. So Immediately, you'll notice that your steps flip right out for you. It's like somebody's rolling out the red carpet for you so that you can enter this luxury hotel room on wheels. The Airstream Atlas is it's genuinely, it's a work of art is what it is. So I'm just going to walk around for a second to kind of show you everything that I'm looking at. Okay, so let's begin. So you do still have some overhead storage cabinets here and here. Now these cabinets, this, they're on this, these uh, the supports right here that's extruded aluminum that is actually built into the frame of the Mercedes. So you're not gonna get all the rattling that you would with uh, some of the competitors. It's gonna be a very quiet ride um, inside there. A lot of storage up underneath there. Same with this one over here. Okay, so you do have this, this sofa right here, very comfortable sofa, ultra leather. This is made by Airstream. Um, so these two side, this one right here and this one right here, the foot rests do come out here in the middle. You have some extra storage. What's underneath there right now is your table. One for here, one for here. It's the table legs and all of that are what's underneath there right now. So what's very interesting about the Airstream Atlas uh, couch this is what's going to be the uh, foundation for your bed, which is what's in the wall right here. And to put that down, it's as easy as it can be. So what a lot of people do not like about the Interstate and other Class B vans is having to put down their, uh, take off their sheets, you know, in the morning time, make your bed every single night before you go back and you'll get back in there. Um, it can kind of be, a, it can kind of be a hassle. So what's really cool about this one, so... I'm going to show you there's a little latch down here so you put your bed down press of a button this comes down okay then all you got to do is you got to hold this latch and then forgive the camera for a second but I got to use both my hands so put the latch and then this comes right down over your sofa so incredibly comfortable bed. Like over here, you got a little headboard to keep your pillows from falling up underneath. Okay. So what's great about this, you have bed straps, all right? So when you wake up in the morning, just make your bed, put these strap back, straps back on, slap it up against the wall, and hey, it's ready for you to sleep in again that night. It's not having to take off all the sheets, all the comforters, everything, store them, take them out again later that night. You can just leave it, you can just leave it made all the time. Underneath them, this very comfortable mattress is the Froley Ergonomic Sleep System, award-winning sleep system, very, very comfortable. 
So back behind here, two reading lights, one here, one here. You can adjust those however you need to. Little USB ports on each side in case you need to, um, in case you need to, you know, charge your phone or anything while you're sleeping. Now, something that I want to show you guys. So these touch panels, you have touch panels throughout the entire coach. You have one, two, three, and there's a fourth one in the bathroom. So anywhere in this coach, you can control every light, every electrical aspect that you can think of anywhere you are. So what I'm gonna show you right now, this is just a cool little feature. So there's different uh, ways to dim these lights. There's a medium dim, a low dim. And then when you're ready to watch a, Watch TV, lay back at night and watch TV. There's a cinema mode. You press cinema mode, all your lights dim, all of your uh, blinds automatically go down, and then your TV, which some of you might not have even known was down there, hidden, comes up. It's a smart TV. It does have a, uh, a sound bar on top. So that is just a really cool feature. Dims all your lights, makes it look like a movie theater inside of here. Um, you turn the lights back on. So I'm gonna show you some of the other things um, that are going on with this right here. So I'm gonna show you on this one, but every single control will have the very same controls. It's just that this is gonna be the largest screen, so that's what I'm gonna show you. So master lights, medium dim, low dim, cinema mode, that's what I just pressed, awning, so if you want to extend your awning, there's your armless awning, it's coming out. Uh, climate control right here, fresh, gray, black tank, LP tank, it's gonna show you exactly what's in there by the percentage, so there'll never be any question. There's tank heaters, so if you're traveling in the winter time, press that, it's gonna keep your tanks from freezing up, water pump, um, start your generator, battery levels. You can do each um, each light individually, or you know, with the ones with the arrows, they're dimmable. Auto gen start. We could spend a lot of time on this. Um, is a very very handy feature. Climate control. So cool. Go ahead and turn that on. It's a little toasty in here. I'll show you how quiet it is. Got your heat pump, your furnace auto just like your home this one right here window shades slide out shade this will uh, put, you, put your slide in or out um, awning your skylight which is up here you can raise that or uh, lower that right here your TV lift so you don't have to press cinema mode to raise or lower the TV there's a few different ways to do it so press lower on this button right here Uh, yeah, it'll go back down. Some other settings here. So yeah, basically anything that you need to do inside this entire coach, you can do it here or here on the wall by the kitchen or in the bathroom. So if for whatever reason those might not be working, you do have all of your manual controls for each of those things in here as well your solar display, your lithium battery heater. Um, this right here is for your uh, uh, your leveling jacks. Slide out, retract, extend, generator, tank levels, LP levels, battery levels, um, where, where you're pulling your power from and your inverter. That's what's all up in here. Okay, so right, right back to the bed really quick. So it's a very interesting size bed. The mattress is 70 by 70 inches. The reason that they do it this way, and I'm fixing to show you. So if you're parked in a parking lot and there's somebody parked on either side of you and you can't extend your awning, you can still, ex you can still put your bed out with the awning in. That's why they made it this size. So it's a weird size. That's why they're gonna provide you your uh, comforter, your sheets and all that. But uh, hey, you can still take a nap going down the road. You don't have to extend the awning to put the bed out. It's great. Now on that note with the slide extended, 
which is an absolute breeze. While you're, while you're sleeping at night, if one of you needs to get up and go to the bathroom, there is a nice path right around the bed where you can do so. So that's everything with the bed down. I'll show you to put it back up. Let's flip this back up here. Once again, you gotta push this latch. Bam, it's done. Sofa back up. Now I mentioned that you do have the electric foot rests on these right here. On this side and the far side, not in the middle, because in the middle, you're gonna have some storage. Now on each side of the sofa, you do have two USB ports. So one for your phone, one for your tablet, you know, whatever it is you need to charge, you have it right there. Up front, you do have more storage up here. Okay, so we'll continue on back. So your floor, it is the uh, luxury marine grade woven vinyl. It's the same stuff you'd find in a yacht. Very heavy duty, kind of soft to the touch. Um, but I'll tell you, there's up underneath, there's a little piece of um, rubber. It's about as thin as a credit card. So this is basically waterproof. You can mop this floor if you need to, but it's tough. It's tough enough where, you know, golf cleats can walk over top of it. It's not gonna harm. Now over here is your kitchen. Two burner gas cooktop. Got your sink here, sprayer. Deep sink, very deep sink. The size of this coach is a very deep sink. Little garbage can back there. Now, I did mention you still have these touch panels all throughout. Little place for your sponges, drawers, pots and pans, whatever you need, whatever you need storage for silverware organizer more storage down here now if you need a little additional prep space you do have a little table that extends right there as well so your refrigerator over here it is a 12 volt refrigerator it is an all-electric refrigerator okay now people often have been asking how come they're going away from the the two-way refrigerators where you can switch to lp well the technology is there now you don't need a two-way refrigerator, you don't need LP. The technology is there where the 12 volt is not going to deplete your battery. Plus this comes with lithium batteries as standard equipment. So you automatically have two times the battery power in this as you would just your standard coach. Um, but it's deep, it's a big refrigerator because it is 12 volt, it's gonna cool off much, much, much faster than the LP refrigerator ever would. Down here is your freezer, very deep freezer and same deal. A compressor style fridge and freezer. Put ice cream in there, come out rock solid. There's no real estate in here for an oven, but you do have the convection microwave. Microwave, bake, broil, roast, grill, reheat, food dehydrator if you're into making beef jerky as you're out on the road, and an air fry option as well. You can do everything that you can do in your home kitchen right here in this little box. Side over here. This is going to be your pantry. You can load that up with quite a bit of stuff. And above here, you just have a little bit more storage. So we do have the AC on. It is the Quiet Stream AC. It is ducted AC, ducted all the way throughout. A lot of the competitors are gonna have that central unit that hangs down that you're gonna hit your head on. It's gonna blow a couple different directions. Well, up here on this Airstream aluminum ceiling, you're gonna have the ducted AC. So it's gonna be the same temperature in the very back, as it's gonna be in the very front. It's all running through these air ducts. I was gonna show you here too, a blackout shade. You got a daytime shade. You have the same thing. So this does open up blackout shade, daytime shade. 
sound around sound speakers throughout. Okay, back to the bathroom. Now this right here is one of the major selling points of the Atlas versus the Interstate is this full three-piece residential style bathroom. A lot of people just can't do the wet bath. Well, this right here is the alternative to that. Sink. Medicine cabinet. Still have some storage below here. Porcelain toilet. More storage up here. You do have a fantastic fan right here, which would you'll turn on if you're having a sh taking a shower. They'll draw all the steam out. Um, you have one over here above the kitchen as well. So if you're cooking, you got some steam, got some smoke, that'll pull it all out. If you're not cooking, if you're not taking a shower, it just helps you know with some air circulation on a nice day if it feels good outside. So this shower right here does have a, a lock on the door to prevent that from sliding open as you're going down. So I'm gonna show you, I am 5'10". I do have shoes on, I am inside the shower right now, and I still have quite a bit of room above my head, probably a good solid eight eight inches or so. I um, had a guy come in here today, he was probably around 6'6", six, six, and he could still stand in here without touching the roof right there. It's a beautiful shower, the lighting looks really good, the teak wood in the back looks very good as well. So, on-demand hot water heater. Got another one of these touch panels where you can control literally everything. So right here is your first um, cedar-lined wardrobe cabinet. It smells really good in here. And this right here, this, this right here is what I was telling you outside. If you needed to have something really tall you needed to bring in here, you could take this out and from the outside storage, you can put it up through here. Here's your other wardrobe closet. So you can also remove this shelf or you can just move it up or down wherever you want to. So you can hang some clothes, uh, decorative pillows here, Airstream sheets that are fitted for this bed, um, Airstream towels, monogram towels. They come with your Atlas. Uh, here's a box full of goodies that Airstream provides you. Um, there's also a box with all the bedding that is, uh, that is outside the coach right now. I took it out so I could make this video for you guys. And more storage compartments. So if you see these throughout the coach, those are your furnace uh, ducts right there. That's when you turn on your heat, all your heat is going to come out through these. And you have them throughout the width of the coach. There's another one right there. There's more, some more around. You know, there's, there's no nicer coach on the entire market than this one, uh, this one right here. It's gonna cost more than any of the other ones, but you get what you pay for. Now this portion up here, the Mercedes chassis portion, so Airstream is the only manufacturer when provided the list of options that Mercedes-Benz offers on the Sprinter, they check every single one. That means every single best-in-class feature that could possibly come on the Mercedes Sprinter comes with standard equipment on every single Airstream Touring Coach, including the Atlas. Every single safety feature. It has all the airbags that you need. It has the, the cruise control assist, you know, lane keep assist, all of those functions that you need. It does have navigation. It has seven-way control seats, heated seats, you know, lumbar support, all that. Everything that you could possibly want inside of, an, of a of coach provided by Mercedes-Benz comes in this one as standard equipment, which makes it the safest Class B Plus on the entire market. I was telling you when I was outside, that's the that's where your rear view camera is going to constantly show you what's behind you. If you change lanes with your blinker, flip them on, it's going to show you the entire side of your coach, the entire lane over. So it virtually leaves you with basically no blind spots. Oh, so I was just saying this, this is the safest coach. It is also the smoothest riding Class B Plus in the entire industry. So here's the controller right there. That's what reminded me. Every single Airstream Atlas comes standard equipment with the VB Air Ride suspension. So 
that's going to absorb most of your shock. You know, if you uh, throw yourself start turning, if there's a strong wind gust, or say if there's a, uh, or if you're taking an exit too quickly, it's going to notice that. It's going to take that into consideration. It's going to inflate the airbag on the opposite side to keep you straight up and down everywhere you go. these windows do open if it's a nice day out you want to uh, want to leave these open you can there's a screen there's also a screen door right here so you can leave that open keep the bugs out so those are the basics of the Airstream Atlas now there's a there, there are some more things to talk about but uh, I'll tell you what, if you want, if you have any additional questions or anything like that, I told you at the beginning I was going to give you my contact information. This is my business card right here. Morgan Mosley, Airstream Specialist, South Haven RV and Marine in South Haven, Mississippi. You see my, uh, my work phone number, my cell phone number, and my email address. If you have any questions at all, do not hesitate to reach out, and I will uh, I will do my best to help you out in any way that I possibly can. If you're uh, interested in placing an order on one of these, you can give me a call uh, or shoot me an email. I'll get you some pricing together. We'll get you a good price on it, and we'll go ahead and uh, get you a production slot locked down. The only way to get one of these right now is to place an order on one. Airstream is not providing any dealership with stock inventory. Um, so, yeah, the only way to, play, to get, get one is to place an order on one. Go ahead and get in the, uh, the line for receiving yours, and you'll get one sooner. Uh, the longer you wait, the longer it's going to be before you can get one. So, just, uh, just, just being fully transparent with you there. Uh, once again, my name is Morgan Mosley, South Haven RV and Marine. I'm the Airstream Specialist here. Um, so, yeah, if, uh, if there's anything I can ever do to help you guys out or to get you inside one of these incredible machines, uh, don't hesitate to reach out, give me a call, and I will do my best to earn your business and to help you out in any way that I possibly can. Uh, once again, uh, thank you very much, and I hope you found this video uh, helpful. Thank you.